William Harvey. Who was William Harvey? Why was he important? And why was his work not important during his own lifetime? Vesalius discovered that there were no holes in the septum of the heart like Galen had said. This was awkward for people who wanted to believe in Galen's ideas. If there were no holes in the heart, then how did the blood move around the body? Also, Galen said that blood was used up as it moves around the body. Because Vesalius had proved Galen wrong on one thing, maybe he was wrong about the blood as well. The man that solved the problem was William Harvey, who was born in 1578. He trained as a doctor where he regularly dissected bodies. He worked in Padua, Italy, where Vesalius had made his discoveries. Later, he returned to work in London. In Padua, he learnt that the way to solve problems was by dissecting and through careful and exact experiments. He wrote his ideas down in a book called On the Movement of the Heart and Blood in Animals, which was published in 1628. These are his main ideas. He proved that the blood pumps around the body in a one-way system. He did this by trying to pump it the wrong way, but it didn't work. Secondly, the heart works like a water pump that pumps the blood around the body. Thirdly, he calculated the amount of blood pumped around the body by each heartbeat to calculate the total blood pump per hour. The amount needed was far more than can be produced by the body, so the same must blood must be circulating in the body. One serious problem was that as arteries got further away from the heart, the smaller the arteries got until they were too small to see. For Harvey's theory to be correct, the blood needed to go through these tiny vessels called capillaries. Microscopes were not powerful enough to see the capillaries in Harvey's lifetime. Why was he important? Firstly, he showed the importance of science and experimentation. Secondly, he proved beyond a doubt that Galen was wrong. And thirdly, when it was proved that he was correct, it showed that people that when you lose blood, it needs to be replaced by transfusion because the body can't remake it quickly enough.